Hi, this is Wayne for Fascinating Tech. Just taking out the um, Eyesaw Extreme video camera. Now for a little walk. There's my dog, Ebony. Say hello, Ebs. You know, it's a bit, well, it's nice and compact. It's uh, a little bit squeaky. I noticed that the body is flexing quite a bit. Um, but it looks solidly made. I'll set it up to extreme wide angle. That seems to be working okay. See lots of curvature, as, as you would expect. This is to test what it's like in general use, picture quality, sound, before I do anything else with it. HD out and a mini USB out or micro USB, the old fashioned ones. Uh, didn't come with a memory card and it won't record unless you get a memory card in it. So I've had to foist one from another unit. It's a bit annoying, cards, £8 retail for a what, 16 gig, £4, £5 for a 4 gig. It would be nice just to have one of those pre-installed does say on the packaging though that there is no well it doesn't say that there is an SD card but it's just one of those things would be nice if it was in there I've been recording for a 1 minute 57 seconds and it's used 7% on my 4 gig SD card now down to 92%, so that's your 8%. It is an extreme camera, so it should take the knocks of a bike or skateboard, and if I could surf, that'd be a surfboard. I don't have one of those, and I'm not a very good swimmer, so I don't think I'll be doing that. Buttons take a little bit of getting used to. You've only got three on there record on off at the top and two buttons on the front of the device with that is a mixture of holding buttons for a couple of seconds so it swaps mode then using the up and down buttons to select and then using the record button press once to accept hold down to back out yeah. Most of the device is flickering quite a lot. It seems to be stopped recording every now and then. I'm not too sure why that is. No, my luck, it's just like the Garmin unit that I've been recording, or been using, and doing, doing it again now. Doing it again now. If I squeeze the top and bottom of the unit, it seems to play okay. But if I release it, it seems to break up the screen a little bit. I hope that this isn't going the same way as the Garmin unit, where I got sent a dodgy one. <laughs> 